Assalamu alaikum everyone. This video is related with one of the documents for your scholarship. So I'm talking about one of the most important thing you have ever need by applying for any international scholarship. So in today's video, I will talk about the recommendation letter. So basically recommendation letter is a kind of document that no student need to worry about that because this is a kind of statement or letter which need to be written by your recommender, your professor, or any other person who is affiliated with academics. But sometimes, uh, in order to make your application stand out as compared to other applicants, or sometimes your professor itself say, uh, you can write your own recommendation letter and just give, give to them, and they can then send by the email directly to the graduate school. So in today's video, I will let you know people what is a recommendation letter and how to write a recommendation letter. And in the last part of this video, I will share my own recommendation letter that I have read, written for um, the internship at all. So you, you people have an idea what the recommendation letter should look like and what, what should be put in your recommendation letter to make your application uh, stand out as compared to other applicants so let's start so first thing is about the recommendation letter so the reference letter or the recommendation letter is a kind of document which is written by someone who can vouch your qualification characters and ability so this is a kind of letter which is which is requested by the employers education institution or organization when they need to assess your suitability for a job academic program or other opportunity so now I will share the one template that you can use for your own reference letter. So this is a template that I made. So the reference letter should start by uh, your name, your professor name, your professor title, your professor organization name, or the institute or the university name, and your professor email address. And then so this is the recipient name means any institute your writer is writing an recommendation letter, right? So, and then you can see here, I am writing to highly recommend, then here your professor should write your name and then specify the purpose of recommendation letter, e.g. employment, your college admission or scholarship. So in your case, uh, your uh, your professor or your recommender should write that I am highly, I am writing to highly recommend your name for the purpose of the scholarship and name of scholarship and institute where the scholarship is given, right? And then I have had the privilege of knowing the, your name and for the duration from which your professor knows you. In my capacity as then your professor designation as supervisor, as professor, associate professor, assistant professor, or some in charge, right? And then after, this is the second paragraph. In the second paragraph, your professor should explain about one one-on-one -on -one experience with, with you and the kind of thing you have done with him or her, right? like this during this time i have had the opportunity to observe your name exceptional uh your your qualities like your soft skill or your hard skill your management skill first then and then uh if you are a girl then he probably use the pronoun she and if you are a boy then he constantly impressed me with her dedication to work ethics and then mention your specific attribute like sometimes uh Professor mentioned that he is always active during the class discussion and he he takes part uh, in any of uh, uh, the discussion regarding concept or any presentation. So you can mention, I mean, you are writing your own recommendation letter. So you can mention your all attributes and then you can just um, share with your professor that is it right or not. After that, one of the most outstanding quality is then mention your key strength or achievement. Like for example, within your university, if you have done some kind of um, uh, done some kind of internship workshop or some courses, then your professor can write these kind of thing here. Like for example, here, 
and then in the third paragraph you can see here in addition to specific quality name uh, he or she possess excellent and then a set of major in context about workspace academic setting so about he he or she is a quick learner and always demonstrate a willingness to take on new challenges which i believe is a testament to her but like that so um your professor can also write something about your leadership skill your communication skill like um sometimes uh, your professor assess your communication skill when they give you the topic to present in class specifically your presentation so your professor can write three or four pre your present specifically presentation topic name in the communication skills right and then in the last they said that in summary i all rt recommend about you and then this is for you and then after this is a very good line you must need to write while writing your recommendation letter is that if you have any further question or require additional information please do not hesitate to contact me at then your professor write your write his or her phone number or his or her email address and then sincerely love you so this is a recommendation letter that just consists of one page so make sure your recommendation letter should be to the point and it should not exceed more than one page right so this is a kind of template that i'm just sharing to just let you know people what the recommendation letter should look like and what kind of thing it must contain and and it must have and now i'm sharing um the the second one of uh, the recommendation letter with uh, you people i can share and now i have here with me the actual recommendation letter that i write for myself to win the internship at oise right so when i was applying for this research internship it was just after my sixth semester and at that time i don't have any idea about how to write recommendation letter your cv and sop and all the other stuff but it took me about two months to completely grip on these kind of things i mean i practiced a lot so i just now showing you my all the effort that i have made to win this internship and not only this internship but other scholarships as well okay so come to the point so this is the actual recommendation letter that you can make yourself and just send it to your professor so that he or she will upload it on an email that he received from some uh, institution uh, specifically foreign right here you can see you must need to know write your name of university or your institute here you can capitalize your name of university and here in a right side in a upper right corner your institute logo like for example i am from the pakistan and my institute is government college university faisalabad so i just put the logo here right and then here the designation uh, about the professor who is writing a recommendation letter for you and then the contact office so this is the contact office which is common to all the university and then the specific uh, specific uh, specification comes this is um your professor designation about who he is or who she is about like he is associate professor or assistant professor and then his or her cell number department uh, like for example i am from the government college university faisalabad and my department is biochemistry so i can put the name of my department as biochemistry and then the email of my professor who is writing a recommendation letter for me and then just scroll down and you see here to home it may confirm and then start writing my recommend so it has come to my attention that miss your name is applying for the name of scholarship you are intending to apply right though many student asked me to write a recommendation letter on their behalf i only recommend those student whom i well suited for program they chose she is one of student and therefore i recommended our institution to give her this opportunity and then in a second paragraph 
your recommend uh, recommender or your professor should write detail about you, who you are and how long he or she has interaction with you and um, how he like in this paragraph your professor should tell that how much he know about you right right and then like like he taught me uh, for the last or for the past two years and then the subject detail so like here i wrote my details here and then the name of semester because uh, when i started my graduation it was 2019 and uh, uh, just after not only one complete year the corona pandemic has occurred and uh, we have two years full two years at home and then after two years our physical classes resume and then we start our physical classes so after corona after online class during pandemic in here in here her or his her uh, semester name and then your professor i did tell about the course work my sister she gave a an outstanding presentation which include so if you have or if you give any kind of presentation during your bachelor's or master's degree so you can specify the name of those presentation because it doesn't happen like you forgot the name of presentation you gave right so you can specify the name of your presentation like i gave the different kind of presentation on some kind of um a gene editing tool stem cells and other so you can you can write your own name of presentation right so here recently she has written a review with me and then practical knowledge and specify the right name of the project related to program you are applying right and and in the end so if you have done any workshop any internship any online courses or if you already won some other um in international internship then you can uh, write a recommendation letter for you and mention all this thing and if you have your highest cgp in your class and other stuff then you can mention each and every stuff but you must think that it should not precede more than one page and also this is the format of recommendation letter for a specific university but if the university in which you are going to apply give a specific template for recommendation letter so you have to follow that rule but if they don't give any template for the recommendation letter then you don't need to worry about that you can simply follow this um this template as well right and then in the last uh, like uh, my professor is saying without hesitation i strongly endorse making her a member of your uh, so this is also a very important document while writing um, your any document for a scholarship so this also decide your selection for any kind of scholarship so this this uh, this document is also very very important so this is all about hope it made sense and hope uh it clear all your doubts regarding the recommendation letter and i make a very very detailed video regarding this if you still have any question then you can write in a comment box because always i had a lot of student that they actually don't know what actual a recommendation letter should look like and what should put in the recommendation letter to make your application stand out as compared to other student so if you really like this video please give a big big thumbs up and share with your um other classmate or friends as well thank you so much